Easter happy first day of April happy what else is today the rent is due we oh yeah we saw the meme yesterday the rent is due it's Easter no 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 it's April Fools it's Easter and the rent is due today <laughs> anyways welcome back to another vlog I'm Alexia Nicole and I'm living my life by design so it is 4 36 a.m. and me and Fawn are headed to work that's what they call it work um yeah we're up so early that the shuttle doesn't even run we have a 5 a.m. report that guy? I think that's our guy lift is here so we gotta go so we've made it to the airport funny thing we get in our lift lift line and there's a guy in there in uniform and it's one of our crew members that we're working with for this two-day trip. We were like, you got to be working with us. There ain't no other reason to be going to the airport this early. <laughs> Anyways, guys, almost at the gate. Time to get ready to rock and roll. All right, guys. Well, we got a five-hour and 58-minute flight. And we only have like six or seven people up front in bed. Her mouth is full of maple glazed bacon. <laughs> I had like seven pieces. The bacon is good, y'all. <laughs> um, so yeah, we have really light load up front, which makes, you know, things easier, but it makes for a long flight. I think we still have about three and a half hours to go. So while I sit here, I'm going to edit a highly requested video for you all that I promised that I was going to have coming. So by the time y'all see this video, you should see, you should have seen that one. So, um, yeah, I'll keep y'all updated. I have plans to go to church. <laughs> so anyways, I've been interrupted two times. But once we land, I'm going to go to church and I'm supposed to be starting my 3k every single day today so that means I have to go work out 3k no 5k 5k a day every day what am I thinking which is like three three point two miles or something 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 so anyways back to editing we've arrived oh Jesus it's just the say three of us now. Y'all. Say hi to Hector. Hector's single. Oh, yeah, yes. Hector, you single? Happily divorced. <laughs> Hector's age appropriate too, people. Yeah. For who? For somebody his age. How old you think I am? Yeah. You're Hector like looking age. good, 37, 38, you like 39. See? Yes. Hector's my age. 46. 46. See? I was just being generous. I was really thinking I'm like 41. 41. So I know if you have an 18 year old, you're my age. Made it to the hotel, y'all. Oh, I'm tired. That was an early, a early show. Um, I'm gonna try to make it. Not try. I'm gonna go to church for 1 p.m. So I think I'm just gonna nap it out really quick, and then I'll be energized when I get back up. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm up, ready to head to church. Just waiting on my Uber. I'm not sure how energized I really am because I'm still really, really tired. I'm in LA. I don't know if I told y'all that, but we're in LA. It's a little chilly out. Last time I was here, the weather was great. Today, it's a little chilly. So, we'll see. I wanted to go to Runyon Canyon. I've never been there. Every time I keep coming there, I tell myself I'm going to go and I haven't been yet. So, maybe I'll do that after church. So, I've made it. This is a line for people leaving and wanting to go in. Let's see. Because if we're turned back to God, then our God is wrong for it. Church service 
sauce was really, really good. Um, they did like a, uh, a combined service. I guess they have a church in Denver as well. So it was online here. They put, I guess it was live, a live combination service of the one LA location and then the one Denver location. But it was really, really good. I'm so glad I was able to come to church. I haven't missed church on Easter in years and I wasn't about to start this year. Um, not that it matters, you know, you go to church every Sunday or whenever you have the time to, but you know, I'm just glad I was able to be in the house of the Lord. This job affords me to go many places and I need to, um, just give him praise for that y'all. Always and forever. They're having an Easter brunch and my crew and some random friends are out here. So I'm eating, I'm happy, no drinking y'all. I've decided to stop drinking until my birthday to help out with my 30 for 30. So I got um, green tea. <laughs> Okay, brunch is over. Everyone was a little bit on 10 from their mimosas, except for me, because I didn't have any mimosas. <laughs> Y'all know what that's like being the only sober person around other... Ow! Oh, shit. I have a crick in my neck. And by God, it hurts so bad. But I'm not complaining today. Um... But yeah, being the only sober person around intoxicated people, you know, it's like, okay, in the beginning, and then everybody else is like, ah, and you're like, here, yeah, that's going to be me for, oh, <sighs> so, that's going to be me for like the next two months. But anyways, I promised myself starting today, I was going to do a 5k a day. Um, and this crick in my neck is kind of working against me, but I'm not going to let it stop me. I got goals, y'all. We've got to get to this 30 for 30. I've, <laughs> I haven't wasted the, the first four months of the year, but I've been working out, but my eating habits haven't been that great. So I'm really buckling down. I have two more months. My birthday is June 2nd. Today is April 1st. I've lost about seven pounds since the beginning of the year. It's not enough. So, yeah. I'm just going to struggle through this crick in my neck. I'm going to go probably just walk on the treadmill at a high incline. Um, and just do some small rotations with my neck here. I don't know what's going on. My body is just like freaking out. I think it's it feels that we're getting close to 30 and everything wants to break down. <laughs> 30 is not even that old. <laughs> So I need to take care of it and um, not that y'all care, but I don't know if it's the flying or I did recently about a month or two ago change skincare products and I've usually pretty much my entire life have had really normal to oily skin and now my skin has changed to like dry skin. So I think I'm just going to give my entire face... Oh, I think I'm just going to give my entire face a break from everything. Um, no makeup for a while. Just We're just going to have to rock with this natural beauty here. Um, I am going to go get these eyebrows done so at least I can look halfway decent. But I think I'm going to stop wearing makeup for a good little while and just kind of let my skin breathe. Because I'm not really sure... If it's just all the flying that's drying my skin out or if it's the new products that I've been using or what. So I need to figure it out because I don't, I don't like my eyelids are really drying. Like around my lips have been really dry lately. So if y'all know of any good like face masks, that's, I think that's the only thing I'm going to want to do is like a moisturizing, rejuvenating face mask. I usually just get those, the ones from Sephora and the little packets. I really like those, but if y'all know of any other brands that are really, really good and kind of gives your face like 
you know, shiny, moisturized, wet look, that's what I want. <laughs> because I'm not going to wear makeup. Maybe tomorrow. Um, but then after that, I'm done for a while. All right. I'm going to get up and go walk on this treadmill for a bit. Well, the gym is completely empty. I guess people don't work out on Easter Sunday. Oh, let me make sure there ain't nobody in here. Yep. I got the gym all to myself. So I got a great workout in, guys, and still not that tired. So I have decided to take a stroll down the street to CVS. I'm gonna get some face masks that I was talking about and probably just like some ibuprofen for this crick in my neck because it's killing me and I cannot, I cannot do a six hour flight like this tomorrow. I already did it today and it was a bad choice. <sighs> made it into CBS. I found one mask, but this isn't the one that I had in mind. Mm. It is a Garnier Skin Active Moisture Balm, which is what I want for dry and sensitive skin. So, it's one mask in here. I might get two because I want to do it tonight and in the morning. I'm remembering now it was a Neutrogena brand mask that I saw um, Jackie, Jackie I on YouTube was using but I don't see it here and they only have one of these so I'm just gonna try this out I guess and see what happens. Alrighty so I got the mask on this is the Neutrogena Hydro Gel Mask. I'm supposed to leave it on for 15 to 30 minutes and then just take it off no rinsing no anything like that and we'll see how my face acts tomorrow um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed as soon as this is done. So I will talk to y'all in the morning. Good morning. It is like 6.30 a.m. I'm about to get up and go to the gym because I'm gonna work out every single day for the month of May. <laughs> well, April. I don't know about May. I probably should do it for May too. <laughs> but um, my face feels okay. Around my eyes are still really dry. Like you can probably see that it looks like it's like peeling the dry skin. Um, but the rest of my face actually feels really not like super moisturized, but a lot better than it has the previous days. So I guess the little mask did a little something something. Yay. But anyways, let me um go ahead to the gym. Talk to y'all later. Let's have a champion. Y'all want to say good morning to the <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> we have about two hours until the shuttle. We do? Shuttle's at 9.57. It's about 8 a.m. Let's go walk to the Hollywood side. How far is that of a drive? Oh, I have no idea. We should. I should have got up earlier and did that. But I know this lazy thing would have still been sleeping. I'm trying to get her to get on this 30 for 30 with me. What that is? Losing 30 pounds by 30. But that was 10 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> 11, actually. I'm trying to get her to work out with me. I've gained 30. I've gained, I've gained 30 pounds in 30, 30 years. Pounds? In 30 years? <laughs> Um, I go up and down. Like I've been, I've been as small as 115. I've been as much as 234. Mm. Right now, I'm like probably 150, 160. So I'm way more than that, but I'm also taller than her. If I lost 30 pounds, and muscle weighs more than fat, I got a lot of muscle. Yeah, I got a lot of fat. But I still want the fat to go away. So fresh out the shower, face is clean. I'm going to put this mask on for about 15 minutes and then that's all I'm doing to my face. Hi guys. Look, on in uniform. She works. Say hi to Hector. Hi. Hi. It's snowing in New York, y'all. I don't want to go to that. And they didn't cancel our flight and I don't understand why not. It must not be that much snow. Yeah.
Say bye to Hector. Bye. Crew service is called Hector, y'all. He's still on reserve. Oh. <laughs> right, so, hopefully they don't have another trip for him. But anyways, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share. Until next time. So, I just finished the trip, y'all, and I've run into a subscriber and a crew member. It's always so nice to meet subscribers. She attacked me. I did. <laughs> and I, I only assumed it was because you watched, but that's so funny. Absolutely. The best. Oh, Love thank it. you. How long have you been here? A year. A year. Yes. And she watches. She's been yes. here longer than me. And I'm still on reserve, and she's got a line. <laughs> What some things can do for y'all. Anyways, bye y'all. Where are you headed? Bye. Tampa. Tampa. Delayed. Delayed. Coming back at 5 o'clock in the morning. Oh, off the turn? Yes. Super delayed. Y'all see what y'all get to look forward to? <laughs> bye. <laughs>